Facing a depleted fuel supply, General Jung became increasingly desperate. He sent orders to redeploy several medium-range nuclear weapons into the field, putting Allied positions in range. His plan was to threaten the Joint Command with multiple detonations near Allied forces. But that plan relied on getting the nukes in place undetected. Unfortunately for Jung, French intelligence intercepted his order. The ghosts were sent to capture the weapons before they could reach their destination. We had to go in covert, because if the Koreans knew we were there, they would have turned the train around. I thought we should just blow the whole thing, but the captain said that was too risky to the surrounding area. The plan was to time a strike to derail the train so we could capture the nuke. My job was just pulling the trigger on my M8. We had to keep those nukes out of Jung's hands. I knew he wouldn't hesitate to use them on civilians. Hell, that's the kind of thing I'd expect from him. This op was hard and fast. We didn't have time for anything else. We had to get in, blaze the bridge, and then secure that train. Once we made our move, the recovery birds would come in to pick up the cargo, and those nukes had to be there when they showed up. It was bad enough we had to fight off the North Koreans, but this time we had to do it next to a nuclear weapon.